Sevgili YouTube hepiniz hoş geldiniz. Bugün Hadi Bakalım serisinde farklı bir oyun daha var. Bu oyunu aslında böyle bir seri olarak mı devam ettirsem bitirsek mi yoksa Hadi Bakalım da mı kalsa çok emin olamadım. Ee, yani tek düzelip devam ederse oyunu ilk defa açıp oynayacağım ben de. Hiçbir fikrim yok. Sadece ayarlarına e, bir göz attım, sesi ayarladım vesaire. O yüzden e, emin değilim. Yine Hadi Bakalım serisi olarak mutlaka koymak istediğim bir oyun. En azından gördüğüm kadarıyla güzel bir oyuna benziyordu. Daha önce Don't Do Not Feed the Monkeys tarzı bir oyun oynamıştık. Adında bir oyun oynamıştık. Bu da ona benziyor gibi geldi. Böyle ufak tefek kamera karıştır bir şeyleri düzenle falan filan muhabbetleri benim hoşuma gidiyor. Oyun şu an öyle aksesli zaten. Çok da pahalı değildi galiba. 20 lira mı 25 lira mı o civarda bir şeydi Steam'de. Başka platformlarda çıktı mı bilmiyorum. Ee, devamı gelirse zaten haberiniz olur. O yüzden New Game deyip bir başlayalım oyuna bakalım neler varmış. Ee, Reji Osman. Bilmiyorum şu an böyle geldi aklıma. Gün bir seçimler. Nasıl dönüyorum? Okay. Hi David, I have a call for you. I'm just putting it through. All right, mate. David, listen. Now I know you've only come in to clean up the place, but I've got a bit caught up, so uh, you're gonna have to run the news tonight. Now don't worry, it's not hard, and I'm gonna stay on the phone and help you. First, I'm gonna give you a quick tour of the broadcast room. So if you're not doing it already, look forwards towards all those screens. Diyor ki abimiz bugün gelemeyeceğim haberleri senin idare etmen lazım ama çok zor bir şey değil. Bu izleyicilermiş. Düşürmemeye çalış. Bunu yukarı çıkması lazım diyor. Bu yayın ekranı. Bu ekrandakinin birkaç sonra, saniye sonraki halini gösteriyormuş. Bu da stüdyodan gelen diğer sinyaller. Ama dert etme diyor, buradan diyor ayarlayabilirsin. Görüntü mikserinden diyor. Buna diyor sonra geleceğiz diyor aslında kısaca. Şimdilik tek yapman gereken güç düğmesini açmak. Bunlar reklamlar. Egzersiz, Sessala, Elon James. Niye girmiyor? Tamam. Yakında stüdyodan sinyal alacaksın diyor. Sinyal aldığında Mikserden biri seç diyor. Şey yapmam gerekiyor mu? Her şey. Three, 
Okay. Tamam. Hazır olduğunda şeye mi geçeceğim? Güzel. Bir de bunu çıktı şimdi başımıza. The opposition parties have all conceded defeat to advance an overwhelming mandate, but have yet to appear publicly. However, it's going well. All you've got to do now is play the advert at the end of the segment. Make sure you don't burn too many of your fired. Now the clock at the top is counting you down to the advert. When it reaches zero, press one of the three play ad buttons over there at the bottom right. I normally play the first one at the first break and so on, but you can play them in any order you want. Gözün saatte tut diyor. Reklam gireceksin diyor. Two, one, go. One minute back, everybody. What? Why? Rank is running late. Thought I'd ask him about the election. Personally, I wouldn't try to confuse him with any big words. That's the same policy we use with you. I thought that was our little secret. I'm deeply uncomfortable with your burgeoning friendship. Yeah. Why are you so keyful, Warda? Wicked. We made it to the first ad break. You're doing great, mate. But this is where it starts getting a bit trickier. This next sequence is what we call a multi-cam sequence because you're going to be cutting between multiple cameras. Tamam. Bir sonraki yayınımız diyor multi kamera gerektiriyor. İşler biraz enteresanlaşacak. Bunlara dikkat et diyor. Konuşan kişinin üzerine kal. 10 saniyeden fazla uzun süre birinde kalma. Reaksiyonları yakala. İlginç gördüğün şeyleri yakala. Reaksiyon duruşlarında 3 saniyeden fazla kalma. Ne oluyor orada? Kavga oluyor. Okay. Thank you so much. Ten seconds, everybody. Uh, Achilles, who are you doing? Welcome back to the National Nightly News. Later, we'll be hearing from the shock election winners in advance. But first, I'm ready to go to Megan on screen four. Is here with the star of both stage and screen. Megan. Thank you, Jeremy. Megan Wolf, culture correspondent, and today I have a guest who starred in everything from Shakespeare. Right, go to Blunderclatch on screen three when she says his name. By none other than Lawrence Blunderclatch. Thank you so much for coming on. Oh my dear, I do hope you believe me when I tell you that being with you here today is a moment. Switch to two for the wide now. May I say, having you here with us is among ours. Right now, just try and stay on whoever's talking. Okay, concern is on the cadets. Wow, what was that like? Well, as I said to Peter at the rack, that's Peter Jensen, the director. Give us a look at Megan's reaction. Lovely. Now back to Thunder Twat. I've worked with him on several movies, all terribly successful. Get back to who's talking. What a wild ride this has been. What a wild ride this has been. I really meant that. Wow, that is fantastic, and. Am I right in saying that the character you play in this movie is quite an academic one? Absolutely right. A scientist. Was that a challenge at all? What exactly are you implying? But seriously, yes, you're right. It was a complete departure from my last starring role when I played Sergeant Brock Rockman in Bullet Man. You'll remember that that was the true story of one soldier's fight for a love that surpasses all others. A love, of course. Get on the speaker, mate. 
think it's grossed over a billion dollars, but it's, uh, obviously, who's counting? <laughs> it's a role that saw you scoop two Best Actor awards, if I remember correctly. It's so sweet of you to mention it, but I really am not in mind. it for the awards, really although those three <laughs> little statues do take those quite a place on my mantelpiece. Uh, with all the others, I'm sure. So, if you're not doing it for the awards, mm. what is it then that drives you? Oh, that is a beautiful question, Megan, and not easy to answer. Like you, like you, I'm afraid, cut me, and I will cut bleed. Me. And often, been on that shop for long. Doesn't it? That's how it doesn't it? Bleeding. Doesn't it? Giving. Bleeding. Suffering Giving. for the one's audience. Suffering for the one's audience. I suppose in the end, I do it for the difference it I makes. I suppose in the end, I do it for I do it for the people that I inspire. I do it for the people The little that I people. But most of all, I think I do it for the positive change that I can bring. Remember the 10 second rule. Today, of course, <laughs> we're in for some real change, it looks like, in the coming few months. What do you make of this historic election result? Oh, well. <laughs> well, now you're asking. Mm. Historic election result, indeed. Historic is the word. Well, it's difficult, isn't it? Very difficult. But, uh, I think. I've always been quite clear that when it comes to politics, that one should always strive to not fuck things up. Oh, well, don't worry, he won't do it again. Sorry, I said fuck. She did it again. Okay, don't panic. I'll explain how to deal with swearing. Which opens next week. Right, I've swapped the shot of Jeremy on screen one for a VT of the movie clip. You'll get a countdown on the screen, but I'll just let Megan cue you in. My character, Dr. Lance Hemlock, is faced with a decision that could affect humanity's very survival. Exciting stuff. Watch out for that interference, mate. Doctor. I don't understand it. Neler oluyor? Okay, tuşun olduğu yerden oynatıyor. O yüzden sürekli takip gerektirmiyor. Hiçbir yerde sinyal yok. Bu ne kadar sürecek onu da bilmiyoruz. Okay, klip sonrasında yeni bir reklam oynat diyor. İki saniye geriden geliyor falan filan diyor. Bu tarz duyduğun şeylerle ilgili problemleri çözmek için bip butonunu kullanacaksın. Space veya tıklayarak. Count one, two, and hold it down. 
only 85 minutes from the coast, and with more than two areas of outstanding natural interest. Isn't it time your family... Remember to select screen one now that you've got the fee. It doesn't wait for the broadcast to go live. That's too late. You can use the number buttons on your key. One to four. Seriously? We've had worse. Five, four, three... Welcome back. And I'm told we can now go Welcome live back. to advance headquarters. I'm okay. told we can now where go the two live to advance Peter Clement and where Julia Zolzwey are about to make their acceptance address. Cut to the outside broadcast. Oh, right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, sure. Right, sir. Oh, Thank you okay. all for coming. Well, uh, thank you all for coming. Where do I start? And, well, what a where do day. I start? They said we what could do it. They said, said we could do it. They said we could do it. Every dirty low down lion. Every dirty low down lion. Every dirty low down lion. Every dirty low down lion. Every dirty low down lion. Every dirty low down lion. Every dirty low down lion. I'm sorry about the language there. I'm sorry, sorry about, about that. the language there. Celebration. Sorry about that. I've had a couple of celebrations. Coarser than the groan is funny. Coarser than the groan. Uh, but to be honest, who can blame Peter for celebrating? But to be honest, who can blame Peter for celebrating? Bu live ve broadcast'ın seslerini ayırmak için sağdakini çok mu fulledik acaba? Ay beynim yanacak şimdi. So okay. Except so for the rich. For them, the party's over. The they shouldn't for be them, the party's over. They shouldn't, they shouldn't be, be putting their shit in pants they on and up in their dusty check pants, pants on and up in their dusty check pants. Again, but again but not in that put. Not before we came out here to address the nation. Before we came out here to address the nation, we used the assets and wealth act. To pass the working with some wealth office, we have to do working with the tax office. Every person in the country is into wealth. Every person in the country is wealth into the middle. I probably you, you rather you don't. Because the likes of you and me, because the likes of you and me, are not welcome in their community. Tomorrow we will be introducing a sweeping reform of the tax system. A sweeping reform of the tax system. No more hiding wealth offshore. No more hiding wealth funds or creative account trust funds or creative account error. Unavoidable set of tax laws. Unavoidable set of tax laws. So all you bastard public school snobs have got nowhere to hide. I've got nowhere to hide. We were evoked to hide. Her şeyini sansürledim adam birden şey gelince. You wanna leave like you threatened. You wanna leave like you threatened before the election. First, fine. You're gonna pay first. You're gonna pay up. Advance are going to turn this country from a nation of warring individuals from a nation of warring individuals to properly fund health and education to properly fund health and education of us to raise the living standards of us all. The fundus said we'd have to raise. The fundus billions. We'd have to raise. You'll see when we reclaim what's ours. When we reclaim what's ours, that's absolute filth. So you posh twats. The people who pay your pittance to serve and drink in their private clubs. The people whose children you raise. The people whose children you raise. The so they've got time to get even. So they've got time to get even. Advance have this to say to you. Advance have this to say to you. We are coming for your sports cars and your mansions and your big sports cars and your mansions and your big yards. We will put the wealth of this country back. We will put the wealth of this country back in the hands of the people who created it. In the hands of the people who created it. Today. Yes. It ends today. And tomorrow, today. we'll start making and it there again. We'll start making Just it like there again. Just like we promised we would. Just and until like then, ladies and gents. And until then, ladies and gents. I suggest we all get pissed. I can't I argue with that. I can't argue time. with that. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Well, interesting acceptance speech well, there. Interesting well, acceptance speech and there. And our apologies for the fruity language. And our apologies for the fruity language. Out for you in time. Hopefully we've got that not out for you in time. Someone's going to be in trouble. If not. Someone's going to be in trouble. So, as the country braces itself for so, the as the country that's braces all from itself us this evening government. at the National Mikey News, all from us this evening we'll be back tomorrow news. with full coverage we'll be back the first day under with the full coverage of the first I'm day I'm Jeremy Donaldson. Have a peaceful... I'm Jeremy Donaldson. Right, looks like you've got it now. Thanks for the help, mate. I've got to go. Ferry's about to leave. Oh. Probably won't be coming back. Job's yours, mate. Good luck. This is not boring politics, then. It's been out of the car. Okay. Nice. I'm not going for a drink. No, not a date. Try not to get murdered. Ended up filleting Satan for the salty crumbs. It's happening here. 
Bakalım. B almışız. Font mu? Aa para kazanıyor muyum bu işten? Sonrasında ne oluyor acaba? Okay, olayımız şu. Broadcast'te insanlar ne izledi? Ona arşivden gelip tekrar bakabilirsin. Diyor. E, bu alttaki bizim ikinci ekran mıydı? Neler olup ne bitti? Arka planı görüyoruz. Bu da reklam kısmı. Hangi reklamları yayınladığına buradan bakabilirsin diyor. Ama bizim şimdi işimiz Broadcast tarafı değil. Soldaki diyor yaptıkların diyor geçmiş işlerini görebilirsin ya da ana menüye dönebilirsin diyor. Bakalım. Well, in a few moments we'll be going live to tonight's national nightly news. But before that, let's take a look at what's coming up later on tonight on channel. Sonra ikinci güne geçebiliyorsa ikinci güne geçeriz. It's the semi-final of the quotation game, and it's a nail-biting quiz tonight as a team of nuclear physicists take on four old ladies from East Grinching. That's followed at 8 p.m. by award-winning documentary series The Shape of Now, which tonight looks at the history of the Sanırım new Sanırım saramıyoruz baştan sona izlememiz gerekiyor. Great blackouts of 1870. Birazcık bakayım sadece. Buralarda zaten bizim şey yapmıyorduk. At 9 p.m. sit back and relax with multiple award-winning movie The Freedom of Being Colin, taking us all the way up to 11:15 where Katlarımız nasıl ya? İyi açılar yakalamış mıyız? Rejide iyi kameralar kullanmış mıyız oradan geçişlerimiz nasıl? Bir onlara bir bakalım ya. Leading economist Katie Brightman. Finally, at midnight, it's the national weather report before we say good night until tomorrow. But now, it's time to join Jeremy Donaldson for the national nightly news. Good evening, I'm Jeremy Donaldson. Our main stories tonight. Moving on up, the election win that experts say. Neyse geçiyorum ya. İkinci güne geçeyim direkt. Okay, güzel. Click on rushes and let's have a look at those. Ah, rush sabah diyor. Sen gördüklerinle gerçek haberleri yaparken kullanırken aynıları bunlar. Aa kamera arkasına neler döndüğünü buradan görebilirsin. İstediklerini mi yaptı bir sesini açarak. Bir kavga oldu bir yerde o neydi? Nasıl açacağım? Ha play diyeceğim sağdan. Şu interview'da bir kavga oldu sanki değil mi? These aren't my cards. Please tell me these aren't my cards. No, they're the right ones apparently. Oh, but this gives me nothing, Jenny. They must see that. I know. I think they think he won't have anything to say. Oh, for God's sake, come on. It's a huge day. He's <laughs> not an absolute bugger. I don't care, Rob. I'm not doing it. I agreed to do one beastly interview a day. I made that completely clear when we started. Check my contract. Hi, I'm Megan. Oh, piss off! You're on thin bloody ice, Rob. Whole wheat, man. Whole wheat. We're coming back from the break. Quiet in the studio. Çok yüksek ses. Thank you so much. Ten seconds, everybody. Wow. Going in five, four, three. Welcome back to the National Nightly News. Later we'll be hearing from shock election winners advance. First, our very own culture reporter, Megan Wolf, is here with a star of both stage and screen. Megan? Thank you, Jeremy. Megan Wolf, culture correspondent. Okay. And today I have a guest who starred in everything from Tamam. Bunu da anladık. Devam. Ablaya bayağı kontratıma bakın ben bu röportaj için bilmem ne bilmem ne istedim elindekine küfür ediyor son D3 mü? 2 ne oldu? Ok 
Okey bir tane bir zımbırtı gelmiş bize. Ee, şeyden yeni seçimler vardı ya işte. Devlet tarafından yeni bir formmuş bu. Ve bütün işte yaşayanlarla ilgili şehirlerle ilgili şey bilgi istiyormuş. İlk sayfa zaten doldurulmuş. Benim adım Alex Winston. Çocuğum da mı varmış benim? Tamam bir hakkımdaki bilgileri böyle böyle veriyor bana sanırım. Diğer bilgileri doldurmak sana bırakıldı diyor. Yeni bir işe başlamak. Ha bu bunun bir etkisi olacak mı acaba? Hemen başlamak istiyorum. Bir arkadaş. Ben arkadaş olayım ve kendimi yeni iş arkadaşlarıma tanıtayım. Niye şu an bunu yapıyoruz abi? Oynatsana beni. Bir etkisi olacaktır diye umuyorum. Söylediklerim karşıma gelecek mi sonra? Ben unuturum ki ama. Hiç almıyorlarmış değil mi? Bunları görüp. Kaç soru var ya? Ben tabi hiçbirini çevirmeden öylesine cevaplıyorum. Değil mi şu an? Hiçbir şey söylemedim size. Unuttum, daldım. Okey. Bir şeyler yaptık. Bakalım. Aile önemli. Önemli aile.
takılıyordum. Tam kahvemi almış oturuyordum. Ondan sonra bahçeden biri geldi falan filan muhabbetler. İşte Chris gelmiş. Chris diyor ki işte bu saatte rahatsız ettiğim için kusura bakma. Senden ee, sadece senden isteyebilir bir ile ihtiyacım var. Bunu sadece senden isteyebilirim. Hayırdır? Bu arada formu doldururken işte şey muhabbetleri soruldu. İşte e, iş arkadaşların performans düşüklüğü nedeniyle falan filan böyle atıldılar gibi muhabbetler oldu işte. Sen ne yapardın o sırada gibi gibi şeyler vardı. Patron attı falan filan gibisinden. Bu bütün saçmalıkları gördün mü falan diyor işte böyle bilmem ne da, bir şey davr sağlıklı davranış sağlıklı değil de işte an bilmem ne davranışları diye geçen niyeyse çeviremedim onu şu an insanların zorla zar zor kazandığı paraları işte tembellikle kazanıldığı falan filan gibi bir şeylerle e, yaftalıyorlar insanları. Tamamen saçmalık. Yani en iyi yüzde bir dayım veya buna benzer bir şeyler demiyorum. O, o saçma para ihtiyacım yok ama bunu e, bunu bile saçma sapan bir hale getirirler bu durumu bile. Benim gibi insanlar her zaman her şeyini kaybediyor. Durum çok kötü ama sana nasıl yardım edebilirim ki? Edebileceğimden emin değilim. Her şeyi alıp götürüyorlar Alex. Hayatım için inşa ettim. Her hayatımı inşa etmek için harcadığım her şeyi. Ne olmasına izin veremem. Senden bir iyi ihtiyacım var. Senin pasaportuna ihtiyacım var. Pasaport mu? Niye? Benimkini aldılar. Benimkini aldılar ve her zaman senin de benzediğimizi söylersin zaten. Geç olmadan burayı terk etmem lazım. Eğer gidersem kendimi ve paramı kurtarabilirim. Ama hesaplarımı doldurmadan gitmem lazım. Başka bir seçeneğim olmasa bunu senden istemezdim, sormazdım. Bu kadar aramız iyi mi? Mutlaka başka bir yolda olmalı ciddi olamazsın bunda. Chris'in ağzı açık kalıyor. Şaka yapıyorsun değil mi? Her zaman sizi sen ve Sem'in tarafındaydım ben. Ha, 
Okey. Hop aileden mi? Ben anlamadım ki. Verdim. Daha doğrusu vermek için yukarı çıktım pasaportu. Semi uyandırmadan. Uykulu bir ses, sessizliği böldü. Alex ne oldu? Bir şey yok hayatım. Endişelenmeye gerek yok, uyumaya geri dönebilirsin. Ne desek yoksa söylesek mi? Ben söylerim ya. Her şey o kadar kötü mü? Nasıl gerçekten gidiyor mu? Öyle görünüyor. Eğer giderse her şey daha iyi olacak. Benim pasaportuma ihtiyacı var gitmesi için. Veya Chris'e göre öyle yani. Ben çok emin olmasam da. En, en azından pasaportumdan vazgeçersem. Hmm. Yani öyle görünüyor. Bilmiyorum. Şu işi çözeyim geleceğim yine. Yukarı yatağa. Hala vermeme şansım var şu an. Pasaportu vermek başıma iş açacak muhtemelen. Çıkarsa çalındı diye ihbar edip vallahi verdim. Normalde gerçekte olsa vermezdim herhalde. Tamam artık o şey yapabilir miyiz? Ben oyunu... Bir bölüm daha oynayalım zaten şey yapacağım. Yine tekste geçerse bitireceğim bölümü ama... Hı. Yine telefon çalıyor. Tuşları unuttum abi araya böyle bir şey soktunuz. Ne habersin? Burası çok kötülü, pardon. Ben mi göremiyorum? Bir daha tekrar eder misin? Bir şeyi fişe tak dedi. Power, gücü aç dedi. Gücü açtım. Hmm. Düğmeleri açmak tabi. Edwards'a da. Pick image A on the left bottom 
screen here or image B on the right bottom screen here. It's really simple. This little clock here will count down the number of seconds you have to make your decision. Provided you make a decision in that time, you're fine. And you can change your mind as much as you want until the clock reaches zero. But if you don't make any decision, you'll be fired before you even get to make another choice. I just want to say one more thing, mate. The pictures you choose to show in these people, well, that's how the public is going to perceive them. And that's going to affect their lives. So like with the adverts, choose carefully. No, and we're off. Good luck, mate. Hmm. Bütün setup'ımız aynı. Alt tarafa görseller geldi bu sefer dedi. Bu görseller ama reklamlar gibi düşün. Gören insanları etkiliyor. O yüzden seçerken dikkatli ol ve zamanında o görselleri verebilmen de önemli. Good evening. I'm Jeremy Dalton. Our main headlines tonight. Destination unknown. At the end of advances first full week in August. We ask exactly who's leading this chart. Tonight, I'll be discussing what the new future might hold with a leading economist in radical free thinking. With the assets in Wealth Act on the brink of raising living standards for the vast majority of the country, I'll be asking my guests if we're on the way to a new future. Aa, burada bayağı dinlemem lazım. Bunlar iyi biri miydi, kötü biri miydi? Sophia Rivington as their new CEO. The following photo, taken from our archive, gives us a sense of this influential young firebrand who, at the tender age of 23, becomes the youngest female CEO in history. Tamam, en genç şey oldu diyor. CEO oldu falan filan diyor. Bayağı takip etmek gerekiyor şu an görsel. Kumar oynarken göstermemiz hoş olmazdı kızım. The markets have responded favorably to Sophia's appointment, the stocks rising 30 points in light of the announcement. In her first press conference this afternoon, Sophia announced a children's toy named Mr. Snuggly House. Sophia promises it'll be all the rage this Christmas, but concerns have been raised about the product's safety. Making a splash. Intrepid scientist Dr. David Wong and marine biologist Ingrid Svorsborg and Horgensford have today set off to explore Dante's taint. The recently discovered cave system was previously thought unreachable, but thanks to a new breakthrough in underwater flower technology, the pair hope to successfully reach the imposing central cavern and the undiscovered plant species it contains. Many were surprised that the two scientists, who've shared a fractious rivalry for many years, decided to undertake this expedition in each other's company. However, the two have released a joint statement in which they opine geniuses don't have to like each other to achieve remarkable results. Playing the field. Okay. Rumors abound as sporting legend Johnny Hamsleeves is snapped leaving Bush, one of the capital's hottest clubs. The footballer was caught while out celebrating being named Sports Personality of the Year last week, as reported by this very program. Johnny is seen here with socialite and performance artist Tiffany Lamour, whose recent show Snatched Inside, Inside My Snatch has kept her firmly in the public eye. Could romance be on the cards for these two budding aces? And give us bodily charm. With advance promising a radical new position on crime, how afraid should we actually be? I'll be going live around the country to talk with people who've seen the criminal justice system from every perspective. With more and more people saying they're scared to walk the streets alone at night, could this be exactly the right time for Advance's new approach? All that, a mega move for the group of young actors already experiencing the positive side of the new Assets and Wealth Act firsthand. They'll be talking and performing later. That's all coming up on tonight's National Nightly News. Oh. Okey. Oyun şunu veriyor bir yandan aslında. Broadcast'te ben bazı şeyleri görüyorum, haberler, takip ediyorum vesaire. Bunun tabii benim hayatıma yansıyan bölümü de var. Kısmında We're talking about Advance's first week in office and what the new future holds. Joining me are Katie Brightman, a leading economist, and Alan James, author of Alan James is Right, The Free Man's Guide to Waking Up. Alan, the government certainly haven't dragged their heels on delivering some of the legislation they promised. But what does the Wealth Act mean for us? Nothing, Jeremy. We're still vassal slaves. We're just in prettier cages. A confident dismissal there. 
Katie Brightman, do you agree? I'm afraid I Katie don't, Brightman, no. I think that Vance have realised that the current economic system of unlimited, unending growth is untenable, so they're changing things up. There I agree with you. They're moving to the next steps in the grand plan. Grand plan, Alan. It's all in my book. Alan James is right, Jeremy. We're to become the great herd, ignorant, sterile and short-lived. That's what they want. Or perhaps Advance have just realised that if we carry on the way we are, we will destroy ourselves and this planet in a mad orgy of consumption, if you'll excuse the colourful metaphor. <laughs> yes, orgy is the right word. Only it'll be the overlords having an orgy on our poor broken backs. It's all in my book. Alan James is... Shamelessly self-promoting. Katie, how do you think the rest of the world will respond to this new approach? I think they're watching carefully. Advance are the most disruptive threat that the world powers have faced since the last great war. Yes, Katie's right. War is inevitable. Thank you, but that isn't And this will not be a war like we've ever seen before. We're talking millions of deaths. We're talking high-tech weapons that can level entire cities. We're talking... Out of the wrong orifices? Mock me all you like, Jeremy. But when they murder your parents and they poison your food and they take you away to their camps for hypno-brainwashing, we'll be laughing then. That might be a great way to sell books, Alan, but you know full well that isn't going to happen in a democracy. Democracy is dead. Yes, advance are radical, and change is always frightening. But the truth is that the Wealth and Assets Act has made more than 90% of the okay, and is on target to produce a permanent Bollocks! What this young lady doesn't understand, Jeremy, is that these are the same people. Maybe they've rebranded, but it's all a little circus act to keep us from seeing the tyrant behind the curtain. That's where you're wrong, Alan. For a start, they've mobilised the youth vote like we've never seen before. You say mobilise, I call it grooming. The grooming of an entire generation to walk happily into eternal bondage. They're like psychic paedophiles. But based on the facts, Katie, what are your predictions? The Assets and Wealth Act is only the first step. Adam çok agresif olabildiğince şu an ekrandan uzak tutmaya çalışıyor. Ama rating arttırıyordur belki de. They're already funneling unprecedented amounts into scientific research in the arts. Or, as I call them in my book, Franken science and Opie arts. Like opiates, see? Can we get back to the issue at hand, please, Alan? This is the issue. It's all coming from the water, the chemicals, they're pumping it full of belief juice. Don't get me wrong, I want to see these changes, but only if they're sustainable. If Advance lose their power after spending half of our GDP on dismantling infrastructure, that could be catastrophic. The catastrophe is that they're succeeding. They've got us sat here talking about their puppet show. All right, we're running out of time. Quickly, Alan. Um, what does the future look like to you, A bleak space where we've all been figuratively sodomized into submission. Oh, of course. Katie? We might be on the eve of a brave new world. God knows we need some change, but we need to be cautious. Let's walk forwards with our eyes open. Two very different visions of the future there. Alan James, Katie Brightman, thank you for joining me. Yeah, come here, when we come back, I'll be investigating law and order before Megan meets some beneficiaries of the Assets and Wealth Act. That's all coming up tonight. On the National Nightly News. On the National One minute back. You know, I think they might do some good. I hope so too, Jeremy. No <laughs> there. Oh, no, I just scratch up the bizarre one. Güzel. Aldı bundan. Replay mi? Okay. Welcome back. In our second segment. We're going to be taking a deep dive into the state of law and order in our country. Advance have already tasked what they are calling a solutions team to move this serious social problem to the top of the list. Tonight, we go behind the headlines to meet the people who live with the criminal justice system every day of their lives. First up, we have Gregory Judge, a lawyer who sees the problems close up on the front line. Can you hear me, Gregory? Can you hear me? Yes, I've got you, Jeremy. Thanks for having me. What's it like on the front line of a hard face with a cold hand of justice? Well, as you can imagine, Jeremy, we are massively understaffed in this country. 
Uh, we're working every hour we can just to try and cope with the caseloads on our desks. Which must affect the quality of support you can offer. Well, we can barely keep up with demand, Jeremy. Uh, there just simply isn't enough being done at a systemic level to relieve the problem. Greg. We need more support from ministers. We need more support from ministers. What are you doing? Well, we need change at a structural level, I'm Jeremy. I'm leaving, Greg. Not a good time, darling. It never is, is it? I'll be at my mother's. Uh, just hang on. Oh, drama. Now, the, the problem isn't a local one, Jeremy. It's nationwide. Just give me five minutes. I'm talking to Jeremy Donaldson. Oh, have you mentioned your affairs? No. Have you mentioned your affairs? Well, uh, the affairs of the Justice Department that we should be concerned about... Hello, Mr. Donaldson. Hello, Mrs. Hello, Mr. Donaldson. We need... Uh, we need legislation to relieve the pressure on our public service. Sorry servants. to interrupt the news, Mr. Donaldson. Can I have a moment to tell my husband I'm leaving him? Yes, I totally understand. Quite the picture of a burdened legal sector there, Gregory Judge. Thank you for joining us. Next, I'm joined by Police Chief Constable Bob Peel, a man with a very different perspective on our nation's crime. Do you think there's a problem with the system, Bob? Neither will do, yeah. I'm sure we all do, Jeremy. I'm sure we all long for a return to the days when you could safely walk the streets of your community at night, looking in through windows and generally enjoying your neighbours without the risk of being terrorised by some thug with a knife or cough. So you feel the streets simply aren't safe anymore? Where have we gone wrong, Bob? Simple question, Jeremy, but I think it all comes down to moral decay. We've diluted it. I've lost touch with what it means to be a great country. Also, as the vicar noted in Sunday's sermon, we probably shouldn't have banned hanging. And to what do you attribute this moral decay? Foreigners, gays, and gypsies, mainly. It's all in the Bible. Look, the vicar clearly states that. Oh, bugger, hang on a moment. Jeremy, a bloody gimp's escaped. Celia? Kendime sansür. <gülüyor> Her şey çok kötü gidiyor şu an. Absolutely Jeremy. Back in your box Clive. Back in your box. Delia, I really could use little help with this. Neler oluyor? Yes, I'm talking to Jeremy Donaldson. Clive, could you put him back in his box? And whose responsibility is it to make a change, Bob? Well, it is certainly not the responsibility of the decent, good, white people of this. Oh, hold on. Iki was mı artık? Clive, I am not having this again. As I was saying, Jeremy, moral decay. Crime is the responsibility of the criminal. No one else. Look, everyone has a sob story, but we don't all end up as barbarians, do we? Look, when our daughter Alice comes home with an A minus, does she go on a killing spree? No, she takes three of her pills and hides under the stairs like a normal child. Thank you, Bob. Bob Peel there, really locking down the police's position on the right. And finally tonight, hopefully uninterrupted, it's time to get to the heart of the matter. <laughs> as recently released from prison, after serving three years for aggravated assault, burglary, and menace of a swap. He's agreed to talk to us today, which is also, I believe, his birthday. Many happy returns, Fanny. Many happy returns. Cheers, Jez. Call me Titwank Tony. Everybody else does. No, I'm not going to be doing that. Does. Can you tell us what it's like in prison, Tony? Titwank Tony. Hooray! Prison's a mixed bag. Structure's quite nice, but it's a constant battle against institutionalization, as you can imagine. And obviously, titwanks are quite hard to come by. I'm picking up that you're not alone there, Tony. Titwank, Tony. Hooray! Yeah, sorry, my friends are throwing me a surprise party. Good bunch of lads. Okay, well, we're told that you get back to that party as soon as possible. First, let me ask you this. Do you feel that your time spent in prison helped to rehabilitate you in any way, Tony? Titwank, Tony! I don't think it's as easy as that, Jez. I don't think it's as easy as that, Jez. Sorry, friends. Yeah, I think asking that is an oversimplification. It sounds like it's getting quite busy there, Tony, but uh, let's try and soldier on. Since leaving custody, have you been able to find a new job? Yeah, all the boys are here. Big Chris, oi, oi. little Chris, oi, oi. and Vampire Chris. Chris. And Vampire Chris. <laughs> uh, niye hep bu tarz şeylere gidiyor acaba? Rehabilitation's difficult with the current system, Jez. It's just not set up for it, you know. 
This is inherently unjust. Inherently unjust. So, do you feel tempted to... I'm sorry, who is this now? You are joking. Chrissy Free Bollocks has only got Mr. Fancy, oh. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. Not now, fellas, I'm on the news. It seems, it seems like we've caught you at a bad time. Oh, I can't really hear you, mate. It's getting a bit busy here. Yes, we uh, seem to be losing the signal no here, Tony. Fucking way, last police back. Well, we're just trying to get that signal back. I think we. Yes, Tony? Tony, I mean, we're literally away for two seconds. How has this happened, Tony? Can you hear me? <laughs> well, we seem to have lost our train of thought there, Ricky. Hopefully, you, the viewer at home, have managed to clean up Çok the whole thing. Of the serious issues around law and order. After the break, we'll be back with some fucking old thespians. Don't go away. We'll be back after these messages. I can't get him well. In this next section, there's a bit of music. If you edit in time with the music, you can see the result on the vision mixer, and the public will love that. Don't worry if you don't know, you won't get punished for it or nothing. Just try and stay in the groove. Also, one last tip when the music starts, turn down the broadcast volume. Right, enjoy the music bit. God, I love music. God, I'm so pissed. I think I might go and throw up in a bit. Müzik girdiğinde broadcast volume'unu düşür diyor. Okay. Gang is the six is living man. Kardeşim niye oturuyorsun bir o zaman ya? And I believe yes, Charlotte's my oldest. I'm the older, more popular one. Yes, Charlotte's my oldest. I'm the older, more popular one. Harry and I were shooting the breeze in the cafeteria. Harry and I were shooting the breeze in the cafeteria. And I said, hey, that's actually a teacher. But she'd been laid off due to budget But she'd been laid off due to budget cuts. Fortunately, I directed a pantomime when I was at university, so I knew the ropes were. Right, yes, you're the maths teacher, aren't you? Right, yes, you're the maths teacher, aren't you? Beynim yanmak üzere. Her character doesn't actually have a name. Yeah, because doesn't actually have a name. Yeah, because all of us, she's like all of us. It's like maybe she's you at home, or like maybe maybe you at home, or like maybe she's you. Yeah, thanks, Steve. Put it in coach. Yes, thanks, Steve. Put it in coach. Yes, thanks, Steve. Right, well, I'm going to have a little chat with your teacher while you run off and get ready. I can't wait to see it. Run off and get ready. I can't wait to see it. <gülüyor> Abicim bir anda kamerayı kapatıyorsunuz ama. Bu 
we were not very I political. We were I'm not very political. She's I'm a mathematician, of course, but she's a pair of we did used to watch that Peter but Clements DIY show back in the day. Peter Clements DIY show back in the day. Why not? So let's have a go with this whole democracy thing. Why not? Let's have a go with this whole democracy thing. And here we bally well are. Okay. And here we bally well are. Let's have a look at a short section of Hey! Friendship. Dear diary, I'm not sure I can take another day at this school. I'm not sure I can take another day at this school. Another day of tears. Another day of tears. Another day of fears. Another day of fears. But still I walk the corridors alone. But still I walk the corridors alone. Dreading what might be around every corner. Dreading what might be around every corner. What's around the corner? What's around the corner? What's around the corner? What's around the corner? What's around the corner? Hi, Gary. Oh, heavens no! It's Gary the Fist! Oh, heavens no! Gary, Gary the Fist! Gary the Fist! Gary the fist. Going somewhere, little first year. Going somewhere, great. little first year. I've been year. looking for some poor great. victim to bully I've been all morning. For some poor victim but to bully this all morning. Me feel about but violent this make me feel better about my violent father. Violent father. Excuse me, I'm late for math. Excuse me, is my favourite subject late for math? Is my so favourite subject? I'm so important. What? Maths is for losers. Just keep going for fuck's sake. Just keep going for f***ing sake. Maths is for losers. Now, give me your lunch money. Now, give me your lunch money. Double lunch for me today, but double lunch for me truly happy when I'm eating. Why am I only truly happy when I'm eating? Not today, Gary the Fist. Not today, Gary the Fist. What do you mean not today? Who are you? What do you mean not today? My arms are you? Brilliant, keep going. My arms are coat. Brilliant, keep going. Who are you to stand up to me? Who are you to stand up to me? Çok kötü her şey.
that's all we have time well, for tonight. Thankfully, that's all we have time for tonight. Join us tomorrow night. Reklamo bitiyor mu? Why bother strengthening your body when you can strengthen your face? We believe your skin deserves the best. So the new formula actively removes harsh chemicals from your skin. Oh, someone please get these twats out of my studio. Okey. Bunu da bitirdik. CM bir şekilde bitir yani. En azından. Enteresan. Ee, oyun adını unuttum o sırada. Dur ana menüye döneyim de var. Dönemedim. Ha, kendime garip garip şeyler mi alabiliyorum? Bir de kazandım parayla. Tamam, okey. Ha, upgrade'ler de var. Tamam, onlara da bir ufak bakalım. Fun. Oyuncak. Dekorasyon. Tamir. Abi de bu aletler bozulacak mı bozulacak tamire ihtiyacım mı olacak diyorsun. Direkt oyunu mu kapatacağım peki yok. Not for broadcast oyununda şimdilik bu kadar bir saat kadar oynamış olduk zaten iki günü arada kaynattık. İşte arada aile durumları girdi orada başka şeyler yaşandı onlar oyunun ilerisinde bize nasıl etki edecek bilmiyorum daha doğrusu şöyle gidiyormuş gibi biraz da. İzlediğimiz şeyler, reklamlar vesaire şeyleri e, etki ediyor ve biz onlar üzerine başka şekilde gen, kendi özel hayatımıza döndüğümüzde muhabbet ediyoruz gibi görünüyor. E, biraz çiğ kalmış gibi geldi bana başlarda. Biraz belki ilerleyen süreçte çok daha derinleşiyordur ondan emin değilim. Oyun ne kadar bir gameplay süresi var onu da bilmiyorum. Ama hadi bakalım için mutlaka zaten çekelim diyordum. Bu o bölüm olsun. Devamı gelirse zaten haberiniz olur bir şekilde. Beğenmeyi, abone olmayı vesaire unutmayın. Öpüyorum çok. Kendinize iyi bakın. Bay bay.